Welcome. My name is Camilla, Equity Research Analyst at CFRA. Today I'll be previewing CFRA's Ho Ho Holiday Forecast. From turkey dinners and family gatherings to colorful ornaments and sparkling lights, the holiday season is undoubtedly a time to relax, unwind, celebrate, and of course, let's not forget a critical time to shop. Retailers ranging from Amazon and Walmart to Target and Macy's generate nearly a third of their annual revenues during this festive time. Our base case is that holiday retail sales, which we define as the months of November and December, will be flat year over year at $1.05 trillion. That would mark the first year of non-positive sales growth since 2008. Our muted outlook rests on the health of the U.S. consumer. Consumer confidence continues to be far below pre-pandemic levels. And while we have seen continuing claims recently make a new pandemic low, it's important to underscore that these figures do not reflect the workers that exhausted state aid and simply shifted to a different program for the longer term unemployed. Another key indicator that we've seen start to subside is time spent away from home. Our bear case is that as infections continue to set new daily highs, the COVID-19 Grinch will prompt widespread store reclosures and in turn, steal some holiday cheer. In terms of what's on consumers' wish lists, we're expecting gift cards and clothing and accessories to top lists again. We're also expecting more demand for home decor and home furnishings since COVID-19 has boosted interest in at-home living projects. This holiday season, e-commerce will surely reign. We're expecting the channel will account for 16% of fourth quarter sales compared to 11% in 2019. Now before COVID-19, there was a group of consumers that simply did not trust online shopping. And that's because the physical store provided consumers with a sense of reliability. They knew that trust would be a perfect fit. They knew that Sofa had the perfect level of support. They knew that Tomato had the right ripeness for their stew. But now e-commerce amid COVID-19 is providing consumers a sense of comfort that they've simply never indulged before. As seen on this slide, a majority, that is 60% of consumers, said they plan to make holiday purchases online this year, compared to 56% in 2019. COVID-19 is also challenging the traditional holiday calendar, causing big days like Black Friday and Cyber Monday to lose their bearing. This stems not only from the pandemic and desire to avoid crowds and shipping delays, but also in part has been spearheaded by Amazon's Prime Day, which was held this year in October and marked what some would say as the official start of the holiday season. So which retailers will make the naughty or nice list this year? In order to forecast our holiday shopping winners and losers, every year we run a digital traffic analysis of Alexa Internet's data. Our approach takes into consideration the changes in Alexa Internet's global rank, or a metric that measures site's popularity. And we look at the three month period as of November 1st, versus the prior three month period, with the assumption that the momentum of brands entering holiday will stay the same course directionally. Now, the reason why we look at website traffic is because we believe that website traffic and in-store traffic are directly 
and positively correlated. As seen on this slide, our projected winners are Canada Goose, Columbia Sportswear, Deckers Outdoor, VF Core, and Williams Sonoma. And our losers are Dillard's, JCPenney, Kohl's, Macy's, and Nordstrom. Now more on department stores. You can see the steep traffic declines the industry has posted ahead of the holiday season on this slide. Now, these drops don't come to us as a surprise. Department stores have been in a death spiral, driven by one, a hefty debt load, and two, the proliferation of e-commerce and next day shipping, which has completely destroyed the historic appeal of department stores for one-stop shopping. Thanks for watching. For a deeper dive into our holiday forecast, please visit our website and register for our one hour webinar taking place on Wednesday, November 18th. You can also contact us at 1-800-220-0502 or at cservices at cfraresearch.com.